Hello everyone, this is Pradeep from Tech and Training Corporate Solutions. I'm here with a video which will demonstrate how do you convert your cell phone into a remote control that can control your PPD slides as well as your laptop or computer as well. In this video, I have used a tool which is very renowned tool and freely available on the internet. There are two modes of using this tool. One is using the internet connection which can establish a connection be between your cell phone and your computer and the other one is establishing a local LAN between your cell phone and your computer which does not require the internet connection. I'm going to demonstrate both the ways which will help you to optimize the usage of this tool. The tool that I'm going to use is TeamViewer. I'm pretty sure that most of you have used this tool TeamViewer in the past. For the people who are new to TeamViewer, let me tell you that you can go to the TeamViewer website which is teamviewer.com and download the full version of a free application. For cell phone, the same application needs to be downloaded from Android Play Store or iPhone App Store. These applications are freely available. I do understand that few of you, those who are using company's laptop, may not have download or installation rights. In such cases, you can go to all download section of TeamViewer website and download the portable version of the same application. This portable version can then be copied to a USB stick or CD drive. Once you download this application, you can then copy the folder and open it from the USB stick and run this application which is called as teamweaver.exe. There's no difference between this application and the one that can be downloaded and installed on the computer. Here, I'm not going to use this version, but I'm going to use the TeamViewer version, which is downloaded and installed on my computer. I repeat again, there's no difference between the portable version and the version which can be downloaded from the internet. If you have a very good internet connection on your laptop as well as on your cell phone, then you don't need to do any kind of configuration to the team viewer. You can directly use this ID and the password to connect to this system. However, if your computer or cell phone does not have a very good internet connection, then you can convert your cell phone's Wi-Fi hotspot into a local LAN connection and you can connect your laptop to that network, which then virtually establishes a local wireless LAN connection. In order to use the team viewer without internet connection, you will have to make the team viewer application compatible to local LAN. And that can be done by going to this extras menu and selecting the options. In the general tab, under the network settings, you see incoming LAN connection, which says deactivated. You just need to switch it over to accept and click OK. After doing that, now your team viewer is compatible to work in a local LAN connection. So here I'm now disconnecting from my internet Wi-Fi connection. And now I'm going to connect to my cell phone's Wi-Fi hotspot wireless connection. And I have disabled the data plan on my cell phone. Now you will see that the numbers which were being displayed here, my ID has now disappeared. And now you are looking at the IP address or local IP address of my system. So now let me switch over to my cell phone and show you how do I connect using the TeamViewer application installed on my cell phone. So people here you can see my cell phone screen and my laptop is connected to Wi-Fi hotspot network. I have already switched over to the extended mode. To know more about extended mode or how do we give presentation using PowerPoint you can Click on the video which is being displayed at the top right corner of the screen and learn more about that and then come back to this video. So taking this video ahead, I have the TeamViewer application on the screen. I can click on that and this TeamViewer application is now started and asking for my TeamViewer ID. I already have access to my TeamViewer ID which is already stored so I'm just going to select that. I get this TeamViewer ID from the TeamViewer application on the remote computer. It is asking for the password, so let me enter the password. And after I enter the password, you can see that TeamViewer has started. And now I can zoom in or zoom out the screen. 
If I zoom out, I can see the entire screen of the remote computer. To control this current presentation, I can activate the functional keyboard. In order to do that, I have to switch over to this keyboard. After doing that, I have to enable the functional keyboard by clicking on this keyboard icon. Now you can see these are all functional keyboard icon. I can simply press F5 to start the presentation. Now when I start the presentation, people you can see a new look of the PowerPoint slide. Now this PowerPoint is in a presenter view mode. As I mentioned earlier, to learn more about presenter view, you can click on the link which is at the top right corner. Using this up, down, left and right button, I can change the slide this way. Now, you need not worry that whether your audience are looking at the entire screen or only the presentation slide. Let me tell you that your audience are only looking at this presentation slide. They do not have access to the speaker notes or the upcoming slide. But you as a presenter now have access to speaker notes and upcoming slide. So you can actually choose which slide to be display now let's say i choose that i want to display the second slide again so i can directly go to second slide and i can click and see now the presentation has switched over to the second slide and if i want to go sequentially i can use the down arrow key which is this down arrow key to move to the next slide this way i can even take the control of the entire presentation now let's say I minimize my PowerPoint slide and I switch over to my computer screen. Here I can open any folder. I can access the content of that folder. I can delete. So I'm able to control the entire system. And the benefit of using the Steam Viewer application this way is you can take your cell phone across the conference room or across the auditorium as long as what your Wi-Fi signal strength is connected to your laptop you can roam around and access your system and of course this impresses the participant how are you using your cell phone as a remote control to give presentation on your system so people this was a very small and simple trick to give effective presentation hope you will like it I would request you to leave your comment about this video, your suggestions for improvement. And if you like it, do not hesitate to share it. Thank you very much. This is Pradeep from Tech and Training Corporate Solutions signing off. Bye-bye and take care.